Rogers. Well, imagine being forced to go to Italy right now in the middle of this COVID-19 pandemic. That's what one family says a local college student is facing. ABC 13 reporter Maida Moreno is live with the story new at 10. Maida? Gina, the Italian foreign exchange student is actually in high school, and of course, her Houston family is trying everything they can to hope in hopes of her staying here. They have been contacting different leaders. Today, they were able to touch base with Senator Ted Cruz's office. They said they will see what they can do. Meantime, they are just nervously waiting. Elisa Siviero is a foreign exchange student from Italy. She came to the Houston area in August, ready to learn and take in the American culture. I go to Cypher High School here in Cyprus. Her senior year now abruptly ending because of the novel coronavirus. My organization, yes, last night, Email me telling me that I have to go back. The organization Green Heart saying it has been closely monitoring the advice and actions from the World Health Organization, the CDC, and the U.S. Department of State on its website just Wednesday, stating, Given these developments, Green Heart is asking our cultural exchange participants within the U.S., as well as those traveling abroad, to return to their home countries immediately. Italy right now is in a lockdown so nobody can go out of their house. Given the situation that is currently happening in her home country, Elisa, her parents, and even her host family say it's too dangerous to go back right now. We think it's ridiculous to, to fly her on a plane in a contained environment into a city, uh, into a country that's on shutdown. And, and we think she's safer here. Tim Banks and his wife are now fighting against the clock to see what they can do to keep Elisa here until it is truly safe to go back. I uh, contacted Senator Cruz's office and Representative McCall's office and, uh, you know, wanted to highlight this situation to see if they could help us as well. More than anything, they want to bring this issue to light. Elisa is not the only foreign exchange student, they say, who is being told to pack up and head back to their country. We're waiting. Uh, it could happen very quickly. It might not happen for a week. We, we just don't know. We think home is the safest place right now. And they hope home means here in Houston until all of this blows over. Mayra Moreno, ABC 13 Eyewitness News.